What's good people, it's Barker and today it is Barker's Bangin' Bristol Burgers. We are on a quest to find the five best burgers in Bristol and we are starting with GBK, Gourmet Burger Kitchen. Let's go inside. Can I have please boss, a classic cheeseburger with no mayo or relish. The classic cheeseburger, let's get munching. That is hench bro. <laughs> yes, so burger finished at 10 on the dankness scale. That's getting a straight 7. Burger could have been a little bit thicker, but the cheese was banging. Price, what we said, 7.95. For a cheeseburger, that's pretty decent. We'll give that an 8 out of 10. Speed of delivery was like what? Four minutes or something silly like that? So that's a straight 10 for delivery speeds. Catch us on the next one. We'll go at Bills. Yo, we're here at Bills. It's absolutely freezing. Let's get inside. Can I please have Bills hamburger? Yes, sure. Um, with no horseradish mayo, please. Yo. We got the classic Bill's Burger. They put pickles in it. Don't do this. The veg is a little excessive. Oh. I can't eat anymore. I'm gonna tag in my cameraman for the day, Jim. Tag. <laughs> we finished here at Bill's for Dangness. Me and Jim have decided a 9 out of 10 because it was a good burger. It was a good burger. Price, the lovely people here at Bill's have given us this burger for free today because they're great. Normally it would have cost us £10.95. So we will give that a 7 on the burger scale because it was a good burger, so worth the price. Uh, delivery and speed service. It took us about 14, 15 minutes to get the burger. So we'll give that a strong seven. So yeah, on to the next place. Back again after yesterday, recovering. We are here at Cafe Kino and we're gonna get a vegan burger. Big up the vegans, sort of. We've got the vegan theme burger. Uh, it's looking good. Okay, rated Cafe Kimo vegan burger. I'm just gonna start with Dangness. This may be a bit biased because I'm not a vegan. We're gonna give it a 8 because I wasn't expecting this to be very nice and you know, it was quite nice. Price, we're gonna give it a strong 9.5 because it was 5 quid for a burger and one pound for the extra fake bacon, so I can't really complain about that, can I? Speed, yeah, we're gonna give that a strong 8.5 as well. It's about seven, eight minutes. For a cafe, that's pretty sick. Great in that. So, on to the next one. Yo, okay, once again, we're back here. Atomic Burger, legendary Bristol burger bar. Yeah, let's get it in. Mental. We're going for the forest gum, the original, the plain. Let's get into it. Looking quite hench, nice little bun on it. Yes, bro. That's pit. Dangness out of 10. We're giving it a straight 9.2. The point 0.2 was because they put the gherkins on the site. Take notes. Price, £8.25 for a burger. That's pretty good. We'll give that a solid 8 out of 10. Speed of delivery, about 15 minutes. So we'll give that a seven. Yes, we're here, the next place. The burger joint, famous place in Bristol. Let's get to it. <laughs> Yo, we've got a classic cheeseburger with bacon. Yeah, let's get stuck in. Are they putting gherkins on it? That's minus points already. The gherkins are lurking. The gherkins are lurking. 
On the Dagmar scale, we're giving it a 9. Speed of delivery was about 10 11 minutes, so we'll give that an 8, 8.5. And price £8.50 for a burger with a free side, so that's pretty sick. We'll give that an 8, an 8.5 as well. Thank you. Yes, it's the review, the feed, the write up, the wrap up, the wrap down. So, first, GBK. Overall, a 25. Bill's price was quite steep, but it was a good burger, so that gets a 23. Atomic Burger was a very, very good burger. A very good burger. We like that, we rate that. So, that gets a 24.2. The burger joint with a score of 25. A 10 minute service, just put it up above Atomic Burger. Just like five minutes of service, that's all it takes. And coming in at spot number one, who would have guessed it? Cafe Kino, the vegan burger. It was like a bean burger with some fake bacon and it was actually dank and I didn't even anticipate it in the slightest. So yes, Cafe Kino, vegans, who would have thought? 